The Munter hitch, also known as the Italian hitch, allows controlled descent with relatively little force using your brake hand. Works great for lowering down heavy things out of my truck. I had to widen that ramp a little bit. That was for a Harley. It's got a curve to it for a Harley. But it wasn't wide enough for my dolly. Anytime you move something with a dolly, you definitely want to strap it in. It makes it so much easier. As you can see, this fridge was pretty heavy. They're backed up with aluminum blades. This is why you don't tie knots in your straps. Give it a little twist as I'm coming. Both over, fold them together like a sandwich. Put that in there. Test it, okay. So it goes either way. So I want it the other way right now. The only trouble I'm having right here is centering the dolly on my ramp. Also, the back end of that fridge is heavier than I thought, so I didn't have it centered on that dolly exactly where I should have. So, kind of wanted to top over backwards. If you pay attention to my left hand, you could tell I'm barely even holding onto that rope. In order to get enough slack to go down the ramp, I have to actually push that fridge down the ramp. Even if I had a second person helping me, keeping that refrigerator from rolling down the ramp, I would still use this knot because that's a lot of weight for one person to hold. This knot works so good, you could see how hard I had to pull just to give myself some slack so I could roll that fridge off the bottom of the ramp right there. This also works great if you have to roll a refrigerator down some stairs. This will slowly descend it down all the way. Thanks for checking out this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Love that. Thanks for checking out this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any further questions about how the Munter hitch works, put it in the comments below and I'll do another tutorial.